The All Progressives Congress in Taraba State says its presidential candidate, Bolak Tinubu, can only hold his campaign rally in the state of the authentic APC State Working Committee and Presidential Campaign Council members are identified at the rally in honor of the presidential candidate and aspirant who won their court cases in Wakari local government area. The APC is insisting that it will bring the recurring Chief Jokon crisis in southern Taraba to an end. It is a few days to the presidential and national assembly polls in Nigeria, and political parties across the country are putting square pegs in square holes to ensure victory in the process. In Taraba State, Northeast Nigeria, the All Progressives Congress appears not to have settled the leadership problems confronting the party, as well as who flies its flag in different elective positions. At the campaign rally, the APC says stomach infrastructure is the manifesto alongside fight against the recurring Thief versus Jukun crisis and revamp agriculture. If he is ready to come tomorrow, we are ready for him. As far as the original APC is identified and saddled and given responsibility to mobilize and organize for his coming, I can assure you tomorrow he is free to come to Tarawa. There is nothing like TV and Jukun crisis in Taraba. It's purely criminal act. And uh, the government that will be 2023, by the grace of God, will work with the little experience we have of intelligence. I know I can put on with the governor that is coming to see the end to this. We will face it. Squally. While the chairman of Taraba South APC Presidential Campaign Council, David Kente, claims they have taken absolute control of the party leadership and that the party has no governorship candidate. Also, the publicity secretary of the state working committee loyal to Senator Emmanuel Boacha says the judgment by the Supreme Court dismissing Senator Yusuf's case has laid to rest controversies of who flies the party's flag in Taraba. Um, at the moment, as we speak, I don't think we have a governorship candidate based on the judgment of the Supreme Court. There is no candidate for now, but uh, the party must be working for us to have a candidate. How will that be done? The party are trying to invite us on an emergency meeting so that we can, I can apply for the review of my judgment. By reviewing my judgment, we can actually have a candidate. We know why these cases have been sponsored against us. I say sponsored because some of the people, the litigants supposedly are members of the APC, but we knew a long time ago that they have been working for the opposition. They are sponsored by the opposition to try to derail our campaign, to try to blot the hopes of the people of Taraba State for a new government. With the internal wrangling within the party, it has become another setback for the party in its quest to take over power from the ruling PDP in the state. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.